we're back to burgers because that's all they've been dreaming about since the first segment. Dreaming of burgers. I'm dreaming of burgers. The whole audience go. wants burgers. Uh, we want sorry. burgers. It yeah. smells really good. It does. Okay, so we're gonna on, make the sauce on, for the burgers. On the, on the sliders, uh, Jennifer's got this recipe for a blueberry barbecue sauce. So it cool. Rocked my world. Okay, so I've got some onion and some canola oil cooked up, and then we're just gonna add all this stuff. Love we're gonna it. add Dijon mustard, and okay. then there's a the ketchup, and there's some brown sugar. You see, you can make your own barbecue sauce. It's so cinched. Oh, you and totally then, can. And then some vinegar, and yeah. mix that up. And now get those blueberries. Get those blueberries, girl. You got it. Okay, here we go. And dump those oh. in. And those are kind of the last of the of the local BC blueberries. So if you can't find any local, you know, uh, blueberries, then go with frozen. Okay. okay, and then we're just gonna, gonna be fresh. They're gonna I be mean, they're gonna they're gonna have that freshness. Fabulous in them. flavor, exactly. Flavor. So we're gonna bring that to a boil, and we're gonna walk away, and we're gonna make a slaw because I have to have fruits and vegetables with everything I you eat. Must. I must, or I'll die. Right. So, <laughs> but that's yeah. why I like your food. There's a balance there. You will never say no. I can't have the burger. No. No, give me the burger, and I'm gonna have a salad. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna have, have a slaw. I'm gonna, gonna have, have a some slaw. Fruits and vegetables. With exactly. It. Okay. That's so good. this is a seasonal salad because okay. um, we've got uh, savoy cabbage in, in uh, oh, season. Nice. And what I did was I just grated it with some red onion. Uh -huh. But here's my my. Oh, I'm so excited. So you know okay. I'm all about Canadian whatever. Yeah. And I think I know everything. Thing. Hello. Uh, <laughs> yes, anyway, I know what I am. So I was in the store and I always look at apples because I always buy a Canadian apple over uh, an imported one. Always, right. always, always. Yeah. So I looked at the label and I went, Canada. What the heck is that? Sweet tango. Never heard of it. A sweet tango. A That's sweet what this kind of apple tango. is. Tango. Yeah. So I did some homework okay. and it's grown in Quebec oh. and Nova Scotia. And it's kind of, if you like honey crisp, it's kind of like a honey crisp, mm. but it's got a little bit more of a tart thing, an explosion of flavor. It does have, and it does have, I like that. Isn't that great? It's and what got a I, ton of flavor. Isn't it? And it's really good to put in a slaw because you don't want it to get lost. Right. And an apple a day might just keep the doctor and the oncologist away. Right. And if you don't have a mandolin, ask Santa for one of these, because oh, honestly, make everything look pretty. wasn't that fun? I feel like I'm on that, you know, I'm at the X going, it slices, it dices. <laughs> <laughs> it, it does, it, you can marry it anyway. So okay. So so there it is. You're just gonna put the the sweet tango. I'm yeah, gonna and, look for sweet tangos. Yeah, look for sweet tangos. They're That's they're, they're yummy, and I like a supporting a new apple. Right. Okay. <laughs> You don't got no love. You to support new apples. Got to support new apples. <laughs> the Canadian kind. There you go. So, uh, and then I'm going to make a, just an easy salad dressing. Did you see that spoon anywhere? There it is. Yeah, there um, you go. Okay, so this is low fat mayo. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to put some vinegar. You can put apple cider in if you want. And okay. a little bit of uh, maple syrup, pure maple syrup. Oh, nice. And just mix that up. So just easy, easy, easy. Yeah. We'll just do that and then toss that all. It didn't do that very well, but whatever. That's and okay. uh, we'll toss it up. Oh, look at you, Miss Sheffy. I was going to try gonna and do the improvise, you know. I was impressed. It anyway. wasn't going to work very well, but I was going to try it. I'm I'm crap at that. I really yeah, I'm, I'm lousy. I when, it's when Randy I don't does really it, throw it up. I like I, everything's going to come out. I know, and then we'll get stuff all over our clothes. Yeah, we don't want that. We don't want that. We use the tongs. There you go. Okay, and there's your slaw that's going to go with your burger. So oh we're my gosh, we're a little bit healthy easy, with our easy, burger, easy. which is great. Okay, so now this is we want this, this is to going boil. Well. And so when it comes to the boil, we're going to do this. I'm a bit afraid, but anyway. Oh, what are we okay. doing? We're gonna we're gonna puree it. So it's not okay. really ready to puree, but we're gonna show you because I think this is important. Okay. Do not, I repeat, puree it in this shallow pot because right. on Instagram you'll see that I was wearing a white shirt. Why'd you do that? Covered in blueberries. Off, you should be cooking in your bra when you're doing blueberries. <laughs> <laughs> My husband goes. Scott goes. You know that you have a bad track record. <laughs> Why would you wear your good wear shirt? White. But I had an apron on. Yes. Anyway, so. And she rescued it. She's I a did. home economist. I, I mean, I knew she knows how to, how to fix, fix everything. I know, so. but it was like, oh, come on. Anyway, so <laughs> do it in a deep. Oh, that's why. I'm going to be over here. You hide, girl. And you wore a white jacket again. I wore what a white jacket. I'm insane. Okay. Wow. But you see, if it's deep, it won't splatter. Okay. But if it was in that stupid shallow pot. It wouldn't have worked. It wouldn't have worked. And yeah. so you just puree. This is not going to be as thick as it should because it should Make sure the thing is completely down. submerged. Yes, do not go, hey, what's over there? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway. Oh, my gosh. Or, am I okay. safe? Yeah, you're safe. Okay, okay so then it's going to look like this. Oh, good oh. stuff. And when I did the, the Bison Burgers, I put cream cheese, uh, sorry, uh, goat cheese, not cream cheese, goat cheese on top with the onion and the, the, the blueberry and yum. This there onion, you go. The pickled onion. The pickled onion. So all those recipes oh. are on your website. Very Whee! good.
Okay, well, since we're talking food, check out the Canadian made 14 piece Chef Michael Smith cookware set by Paderno for all your holiday entertaining needs. Look at that. After the show, we're going to draw for some of those sets. They're Woo! beautiful. If you want more info, go to the shopping channel and tsc.ca for special deals this Saturday only. Break time. Stay with us. More coming up. Man, that looks good.